Good evening everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. Today is a Friday and not much happening. It's just a little trend here and there, but there is nothing really special about today. Uh, we still have uh, a few charts open. Uh, we have the gold uh, still have an open trade on 7360. You can see it from the controller. Uh, now we have the Nasdaq still open on the four minutes, uh, 4900, and we have the ES four minutes, uh, which is 2400, and uh, we have the Nasdaq 5000, and the Nasdaq five minutes 5000. The rest, it was a normal day. If we look at the chart, we had a little trend today. Uh, you can see that from other channel, the live channel we have. And uh, it was done around 11 o'clock. And look at this. You see? Nothing. Flat. And this is most of the market was the same today. And there is nothing. So whoever catch the trend in the morning, and uh, the first trade was okay. And then... Also on the on the other channel we said uh, once uh, we got below the technical level we said there is no more trade and uh, you can see the link below the video and uh, look at it and uh, we we predicted right on the spot uh, on the gold uh, the four minutes it was a beautiful V shape entry and exit. And that's what really saved us today uh, on the four minutes 2600 and again <coughs> excuse me on the gold is two minutes uh, we we hit the target by 11 o'clock if we continue this is a neutral area we could have got a little small trade in here but we were done uh, by 11 o'clock when the auto trade stopped The gold is 5,300 and it was done today. The gold was really running uh, 11 by 11 o'clock. We were done with the gold. And on the uh, DAX, 3,000 uh, by 10 o'clock, 10.30, we were done. Uh, on the uh, NASDAQ, uh, 600 takes. It's 2400. It's always a stable, the 600. Nothing special. It's just a stable. However, if we continue trading on this and did not hit the target, we would have got another $4,000 trade in there. But that's life. Welcome to trading. And uh, NASDAQ at uh, the 550, 2000. And the ES also, the morning session, the European hours was much better than the uh, US session. And on the European hours, this one here is not included in, in that. This one here was a little over 6,000. And here, it was a losing trade and then a winning trade. We started this morning and we were done by 11.30. And this is uh, the session for the US market, we started right there. This one here was from the European market, which we missed out on this one here. That's life. On the uh, NASDAQ two minutes, it did very well. And you can see when it was done around 11 o'clock, not much going on. Would have made a big deal here, maybe another three, 4,000. Yeah, but how would we know? Anyway, the market hit the target around 11 o'clock. Four minutes, uh, 1,100 YM. Uh, the ES, one minute, 2,300. If we look at the one minute, if whoever continue, we were done around 11 o'clock. All of them, they were done around 11 o'clock. If we continue, uh, we would have got another 3,000. 4,000 somewhere around there this one here 1920 on the Nasdaq 
Nasdaq 500, 1955, and uh, the uh, Nasdaq 650, 2200. Uh, for the market analyzer, it is based on one contract on the last entry signal. We nailed 149 takes, not all day, only the last entry, based on one contract only. Those numbers on every single member have the same numbers. Uh, the uh, ES on the last entry signal got 150 takes. There is five different automated trade in this uh, uh, market analyzer. There is 200 ticks into profit on the NASDAQ and there is 24 ticks into the profit base on the last entry signal, not the whole day, the last entry signal. And the CL just took an entry and it is just eight ticks, just took it, it's right there. You can see it. Folks, that's all what we have for you today. Uh, we wish you a very, very pleasant evening and a happy weekend. Thank you very much. Bye for now.